Hi everyone, this is a video that I promised you that I'm going to show you. Uh, this is a block converter, a step down. You just connect 12 volt to this positive and negative here. It doesn't have any indication that which one is positive or negative, but after reading the papers about this, I realized that this one is positive and that one is negative. So, this uh, the specification for this, I'm going to show you shortly. This is the USB charger that I wanted to add to my desk lamp that is already installed and I'll show you shortly after. First, let me show you the specifications. And the specifications are like this. If you want to read, you can pause and read. They say this one can produce 3 amp output. But, uh, you know, I couldn't get more than an amp out of it and it was getting really hot but I was using a very good cable which is attached already to here and I'll show you shortly how uh, it works but uh, let me just show you the <coughs> the lamp, desk lamp here is the desk lamp and I have added this unit to there like so inside and it's okay it does the job but it's getting really hot here uh, as I mentioned this cable if you can see that the cables in here they are really fat cables uh, I don't know if I turn the light on if you can see that I don't think so let me just use the torch still oh here uh, it's a little bit too bright I guess but you can see that the cables those are uh, braided cables positive and negative without any shielding and it is really thick and is uh, drawing loads of amperage so I also put a switch here to activate the USB so we don't need this always to be on and I wanted a white one I ordered a white one and the white one is uh, in the post and is going to arrive soon and we just turn it on and it has a light in this corner let me just focus this In this corner it has a red light that I'm going to show you shortly again and this is the module and I have the other one connected ready for the test I just have to connect it to the 12 volt and there it is connected to turn 12 volts and that is the light LED light that I showed you and let's see how much it draws from for my Galaxy S7 
at the moment it draws uh, 650 milliamp and as it goes to 900 milliamp the voltage drops to 4 volt 99 but it still is adequate but my only worry was that it was getting hot around here around the USB out but I guess you never know because I made this myself so normally they are not exposed for you to feel the heat around the USB and as you see the amperage is going down and the voltage is going up and I, I have no idea why that one is much stronger than this one in case that you don't know this one is connected to 12 volt 5 amp and that one is 12 volt 1 and a half amp this so let's try with a, a lamp to see how much we draw from there so now 5.1 and here we have 260 milliamp and now turn it on maybe you cannot see there but we have 5.02 volts at 450 milliamp hour and it's charging it's a good module and also although that is getting hot but none of these components were getting hot at all I'm going to recommend this the price for this I purchased this from eBay as usual and the price was uh, for three of them was four pound fifty and the seller is this chap so if you want this is a very good deal that is offering from uh, UK not from China so I fully recommend this item for the price and the number of the units that is offering you okay I won't take much of your time this is supposed to be a short video about this uh, step down buck converter which is there are many videos out there but uh, because of this project that I'm doing I was doing you know I wanted to show you this as well so next move is to change this switch to a white one I'm still waiting it waiting for it to, to arrive through the post and it's a bank holiday and soon is going to be changed so until my next video take care of yourself and each other and the price I think I believe I showed you £4.50 have a great weekend and have an even better bank holiday